Hello, I'm Atuba George and I'm so excited. This is a new week and we are going into God's truth. Well, this week we're going to be talking about the result or the effect of walking righteously. Praise God. And I pray in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ that everyone listening and watching this video, they come under the influence of God's spirit. And burdens are removed, yokes are destroyed right now. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Now we're going to be looking at Psalm 112 for this whole week. Now we're going to be taking two verses per day. And, and I trust the Spirit of God to open your understanding and bring forth His truth into your heart. Praise God. It says, Praise ye the Lord. Blessed is the man that feareth the Lord. Now, now when you see that word, feareth the Lord or fears the Lord, now, this is the same thing that if it was rendered in the New Testament, you would have seen them say, Blessed is the man that loves the Lord. See, so to fear God is to love Him. He's not talking about the terrifying fear. Ah, I don't want to go, ah, I fear God though. No, He's talking about, I just love God. I always want to do what He tells me to do. Praise God. Because Jesus said, If you love me, keep my word. So God doesn't lead us with fear. See, he leads us in love. Now, I needed you to get that. So, blessed is the man that feareth or loves the Lord, that delighted greatly in his commandments. Now, look at what the blessing is. See, he didn't just say, you are blessed. Now, what is the content? What is the blessing really? The first thing he says in verse 2, he says, His seed shall be mighty upon earth. The generation of the upright shall be blessed. Did you see that the blessed man or the righteous man, the, the one who honors or reverse the word of God, the one who loves the word of God, he, he, he delights greatly in it. He says his seed, his generation shall be blessed. Now let me read this from the Living Bible. He says, verse 2, he says, His children shall be honored everywhere. For good men's sons, have a special heritage. Did you see this? The seed of the good man. The seed. Who's the good man? Not just, I like that man. He's very good though. What do you mean he's very good? He's just smiling at everybody. Does what everybody wants. Doesn't mean he's good. <laughs> see, you can be good in the sight of men, but in the eyes of God, you are evil. You understand what I'm talking about? So we're not talking about face facial goodness we're not talking about religious goodness we're talking about the one who god looks at and say you are good see so you've got to be good in god's sight now how would you know a good man look at his children now do you know what this tells me the good man or the man who loves the word of god will have children that's what it means if the first blessing he's saying is about his children let me explain this to you clearly Every work God begins in you doesn't end with you. When God picks a man, man up, he is looking at a whole lineage. See? That's why he takes time to set the foundation of your life. So sometimes you think, oh, why is God slow? God should hurry now. He is, he is building something for your whole lineage. So if you walk with him perfectly, then you are taking the bulk of the work. So your lineage, your generations after you, the children after you, are going to enjoy the presence of the Lord. And that's how it works, praise God. So, so he tells me he will have children. So in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, if you are walking with the Lord in all sincerity, and you've been having an each challenge, you know, having children, I stand with you in agreement right now that this blessing will be made effective in your life. I activate this blessing into your life right now. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Let your wife or woman conceive right now. And bring forth the seed that shall carry on the blessing of God upon your life. For which you have been working for. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. But look at it. It says, the, 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 um, the, 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 the living Bible says, His children shall be honored everywhere. See? His children shall be honored everywhere. For good men's sons have a special heritage you you want to live a life that anywhere your children go to the moment they mention that i'm, I'm so so and so son 
Wow, come come over here, come over here. That's what you want. Now that's the blessing of walking. Now who does this? Not you, God. I mean, when you're a good man, you don't need to call someone and say, come on, my son is coming, oh, please assist him, oh, you know I helped you before. No, 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 once you're a good man, God himself, even when your children go to a place and they just want to hide, God will fish them out and bless them. Praise God. Now that's what you want. So, Put yourself down and begin to revere the word of God. Honor the scriptures. Honor the commands that God gives to you. And you surely going to see this work in your life. Praise God. We're going to continue tomorrow. Until then, have a beautiful day. Bye-bye.